Hello, David A. Rogers here again, and I want to share with you something inside of Photoshop which I think you'll find extremely useful once you know about it if you don't already know about it. This is one of my favorite hidden gems, and it has to do with the history panel. Let's have a look at the history panel. We'll go into the window menu, and if it's not already showing, you'll find it right there, history panel. Now, the history panel will allow you to go back in time, so to speak. So if you make mistakes, then you can just step backward using Command or Control Z, or Command Option Z, whichever you wish, or you can find it up in the edit menu, step backward, step forward, or undo. Okay, well that's all well and good, but after about 20 steps, by default, you've run out of options and you can't go back any further. What if you wanted to go back to an hour ago, or 10 minutes ago, for example? Well, there's, a, there's an option inside the history panel, which I absolutely love, and I make sure it's checked all the time. If we open up the history panel options, it's the second one in the list. Automatically create new snapshot when saving. Because as I'm working on a file, it could be hours that I'm working on a file, it could be minutes, it doesn't matter. I will generally save on a regular basis after I've done something really crucial or when I'm about to do something that I find might be a little bit destructive. So this one will create a new snapshot every single time you save. What does that mean? Well, if I open up my history panel here, you'll see I've worked on this file for quite a while. So I can go back all the way to there or all the way to there simply by clicking on those particular history states. Those are the snapshots that it's creating automatically every time I save the file. If I was to do something to the file now and press Command S to save, it's created another snapshot without me having to do anything. That means if I do something really destructive now, I can go back to this particular point in time. So that's a hidden gem that I find really, really useful. Hope you will too. Bye.